Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm Roxanne and this is my unboxing channel. Uh, today we are going to be doing Top Box and the $25 mystery box. Um, just so you know, Top Box is a Canadian box. It, it, um, it costs $15 a month plus taxes. Shipping is included in that. It takes payment on the 20th. Um, it sends out an email between the 23rd to the 28th asking um questions and surveys um some of the things are uh some of the questions will be did you like your ta la last top box did you use this product did you not you know and if you want foundation in your next box what uh what you know what type of skin do you, skin do you have it also has the prev options you can uh upgrade your box um you could choose like say i think last month they had a mark jacobs um eyeliner I had uh, oh a bite um, lip balm or sort of thing so anyway those are the things you can get you can trade in your normal box for that or you can get your normal box which I of course did I'm not sure I like the sounds of that. Okay. then they have one of boxes limited edition boxes which this is this sold out pretty quick I snapped it up and I have seen the spoilers, and I am not going to lie, I am a lot worried. Um, I didn't even open this up, guys, so... Um, oh, there we go. Just use this. Sorry, I didn't even realize it would be taped. So let's start with um, my box, my regular box. If you decide to sign up, which I don't know if you will after seeing my box, because, you know... I've seen some pretty nasty spoilers. Um, now's the time to do it, and you can use my referral link. All I get is like a $5 code uh, off my next limited edition boxes. Okay, so... Okay, winter, each box is carefully selected. Have fun testing out your products, and don't forget to fill out your wish list survey at the end of the month. We can't wait to see all the exciting pre-boxes that are available for you to wish for. Okay. So I got Glow Manicadar Glow Shimmer Lotion 3. Okay. Next thing I see is Fisherman Friends Extreme Lip Care Sea Buckthorn Cit Citrus. Um, I have been using the maple one, I will likely use this one. Hmm. Citrusy. I like that kind of stuff. Although they said it's like winter box. This is not a winter box. I also got a Cleo Noir eye pencil. And that's not even full size. And the one, two full size items I got are the skincare and the nail polish in like a mint green which really isn't my color. Okay, so um, it's kind of pretty. Okay, so it's an interesting color. Um, it's, it's like a mint green, and I've got it all over the place, of course, because, you know, that's what I do best. Can't go back on. And it's got a bit of a shimmer to it, so I might actually give this a try, but uh, not today, because, yeah. All right, so that's what I got for $15. That isn't exactly impressive, especially when I saw somebody get a full-size Kalela Cannabis Sativa, six-time the pain relief item. And again... <clears throat> that's top box for you. I'm pretty disappointed. So let's see if the $25. Okay, so I see the Prairie Last Coconut and Graham Berry Coconut Oil. Uh, I have this from them. Um, I knew that this was going to be a repeats of um, some of the stuff they had from last year. So, Delectable Triple Moisturizing Body Lotion Coconut Cream. 
this is a Canadian brand, so that's not too bad. I don't mind that. I am running low on it. Uh, Lorizzi Waterproof Mascara. I actually don't have waterproof mascara, so I will probably give this a go. Remember me saying I cannot open these? Cannot open these. So let's see if this works. I have a smashing headache for today. Okay, so anyway, I will probably give this a try. This is full size, so that's nice. I believe this is um, full size as well. Um, let's see. Okay, so that's got a nice, nice little brush. Okay, so I'll give that a try. I'm not a big fan of Loritzi, but I will try that. Okay, so the next item I see is... Um, yeah. The one box I wanted, of course, I couldn't get. Like, there's two boxes for top box and then for these. And, of course, I didn't get either one because, you know, top box hates me. Okay, so this is Luna by Luna. This is a highlighter. Um, as some of you may or may not know, there's a lot of drama going on in the beauty world, of course. Um, this is one of the brands right here. It's owned by one woman who, um, apparently has the fascia stuff that's going on. This does not look like a highlighter. This looks like... Okay, maybe it is. I don't know. It kind of has a weird smell to it. Or it could be the lip balm, I don't know. Okay, so uh, anyway, apparently she owns this company as well. Okay, so it says here it's distributed by DSO Cosmetics in Wickatuck, New Jersey. And this one's in Freehold, New Jersey. Okay, so this one is made in China. Both of them are actually made in China. Okay, so let's try this trick again. Uh, I'm not going to sit here and lie to you. I'm probably just going to throw this stuff in the garbage. I'm not even going to try and get it away. So this is a bronzer. I mean, it's kind of a pretty crappy bronzer. Um... I got hand and body lotion from Earth Safe. You know, three body lotions. I've got, you know, one body, so that's nice. Um, Earth Safe, I believe. I have their um, shampoo and conditioner upstairs, and I do not mind it. Okay, this is from Avaria Health and Beauty Corp. This is actually a Canadian company. Um, their stuff is actually made in, I believe, Kitchener or Waterloo. Um, Formaldehyde free, plant derived. Okay, so Earth, oh, that's interesting. Earth Safe, I didn't realize that they own that. So this is Aloe Fruits and Passion Cream Body Lotion. Okay, another body lotion. Okay, so this is made in Quebec. This says six months. Once you open it, it's got a nice light scent. That's actually kind of interesting. Um, I don't know if you how, if you can see the texture of that. That's um pretty interesting. I'll probably give that a try. Kind of smells like um, conditioner. I need stuff for my hands, so I don't mind that getting some stuff for my hands. So this is peeling so good berry peeling pad. How to use easy to use and superb peeling pad with strawberry, raspberry, blueberry, extract to remove makeup residue, fine dust, dead cells for naturally purified skin. Okay, gently rub the white cotton side of the pad on your dry face in circular motion. Use a boss mint color side to focus on your nose and chin. Rinse with 
lukewarm water you got glow actually um i got I have these upstairs not from this company um from a different company this is says it's vegan it's made in the usa oh no it's made in korea um i actually like these so this isn't such a bad thing but it's probably just one which really sucks Okay, right, so the next item I see here is Nude by Nature Perfecting Primer. This isn't a bad primer. Um, just sucks because it's so tiny, like it's super tiny. And then the last item my daughter will love. This is um, Revlon Instant Beauty, Instant Love, Hydro Nutritive. All right. You know, I tried really hard not to be disappointed by this, but now this just pisses me off. I don't know what's going on with that box like they send out super awesome boxes get everyone to sign up and then they're like ha ha we fooled you all right so with that being said um i had this whole plan like i was going to say there's an issue here there's a problem um this month absolutely sucked with that box it's such a sucky <sighs> hit and a miss and it's so freaking annoying I'm like, I'm not going to cancel because they're going to come up with a Huda palette again. Oh, I'm not going to cancel. I'm going to hold on. Honestly, I don't even know what to do anymore. Seems like such a long day today. And this just, I just wasted my money and I don't really like that feeling. Okay, so with it being said, um, I was going to ask you guys... And hopefully maybe Top Box will watch this video, or maybe they won't, I don't even know. But maybe they could read the comments, and we could put in the comments stuff that we would like to see in a box. Um, one of the things I would like to see is Visanti products. Um, Visanti is a Canadian, uh, at least they make some of the products here in Canada. They've got uh, lip pencils, they've got <clears throat> lipsticks, and they've got uh, different kinds of makeup. That'd be nice to see, as well as uh, Lise Watier, uh, another Canadian um, company. Um, I would actually almost prefer to go back to the Masquerade and the Delectable products in the boxes, because at least they are quality products. They were repetitive, but... <laughs> <laughs> um, with that being said, um, another thing I would like to see in boxes is actually hand masks. We don't often get those, and I do like them. Um, what else would I like to see? Um, maybe like a small sample of uh, brush shampoo. Um, you know, something like that. Like... Like, even this month, there's not even, like, in my box, at least, there's, I don't know, like, the nail polish is pretty. I'm not going to lie about that, but it's not a winter color. It's more of an Easter color. It should have been out in Easter boxes. So, anyway, um, the two of the, the products are going straight in the trash. trash I'm not going to lie. Um, each of these items, I believe I probably could have purchased for less than $25. Like, I don't even know if this is... A full size. I do like the bottle. Um, my my daughter actually kind of needs this. Um, so okay, fine. But I mean, I would have saved all my money if I just bought this. Um, like, what is going on? <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end the video here. As you can tell, I'm completely frazzled. Um, before I end, end the video, I just wanted to show, um, I finally got a chance to use the, uh, berries, the Dose, Dose of Colors, Dose of Colors, no, Dominique Cosmetics, sorry, and I absolutely love it, it is, there is some fallout with it, but, uh, I'm going to play with it a little bit more before I decide that I don't really like it, but, um, I used a lot of products from my... Beautylish bag, um, the dose of color, or Dominique Cosmetics, the Wonder Lip. Um, I did try out the foundation, Wonder Foundation I picked up from Ipsy. I really like it. It went on really easy. It's staying. Um, it's really great. I'm going to probably try out my Becca again and maybe try the other color for it. As you can hear, my daughter <laughs> is upset right now. She's in the bathtub. So I'm going to end the video here. But drop a line, tell me what you would like to see Top Box pick up, whether it be a Canadian company, 
whether it's sample sizes or full size products, give them some ideas. Um, you know, pull out some colors and some, you know, um, give them some ideas. Maybe give them a direction on where we want to go with them. Um, but for now, I believe I know a lot of you have canceled and um, I'm sorry that had to happen and I certainly do understand it. Let's just see if <clears throat> Top Box is going to pull up its pants and, uh, you know, give us something over the summer to su surprise us and reward some of our, uh, some of us for our loyalty during these awful months. Awful. As for the surprise boxes, I'll probably still buy them because I do like getting the surprise in the mail. Although this month I will say that they did completely rip me off because there's no way that this costs this much money for any of these items separately. So anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. Have a great night.